A bizarre story of censorship as Twitter suspends horror movie directors from the platform after releasing their film's trailer. One America's Jack Posobiec spoke with those directors to learn more. We're very excited to welcome to One American News Jen and Sylvia Soska, the Soska sisters. They're horror movie directors out of Hollywood, and yet you've had your Twitter account banned for the crime, apparently, of promoting your new movie. Tell me what happened. We were promoting the world premiere with a banner from Fright Fest, and I got a notification from Twitter that uh, I had printed, posted something obscene and they were going to take it down. And uh, they gave me the option to take the photo down, and I did. And uh, I just re-uploaded it right after because I thought it it was honestly a joke. I'd never seen anything like that before. Yeah, especially since the image is being used everywhere by the film festival Fright Fest, which gave us our big start with our second film, American Mary. All the fans, the horror sites. I feel we've really just been singled out. Yeah. So tell me about what what is the new film, and then what was the image itself? Well, the film is a remake of David Cronenberg's second film, Rabid, which is about a biological vampire. And our film talks about transhumanism and, you know, what happens when people uh, play God and the moral and ethical kind of horrors that come from that. Uh, the image that we showed showed our uh, star, Laura Vandervoort, with some prosthetics from our team at Master of Effects. MPAA approved already. Yeah. The image uh, of Laura's face has appeared on both the cover of Rue Morgue and Fangoria and uh, countless other publications. Has there been any appeal process or any, uh, any messaging with the Twitter staff? I haven't heard anything from them. I've appealed it several times. Someone told me that I should let them know that the MPA uh, approved it, that it's been on the cover of different magazines, but I've heard nothing about it. Now, what do you, when you talk about that punishment, when you talk about that silencing, what does that do to you as a creator, knowing that something that you've created could then cause you to be shut down? We don't have the huge marketing campaign that these huge studio films have. Everything we do is very grassroots. It's very, if you see a review, someone has seen the yeah. film, nobody has fed them their opinion. So to have this happen to us right as we're announcing our film, it just really ties our hands. It really takes away what ability we have to talk about our art. And it's an important message in our film, too. Where can people to go to find out more about the film and hopefully see it when it comes out? Oh, awesome. You can go to Facebook. You can go to uh, Instagram. We're the Saska Sisters. We handle all of our social media ourselves. We're also Twisted Twins Productions. That's us handling all of that. I know we're going to be back, Twitter. You can't keep us out for that long. So I'm um, very grateful for that. And if you want to share the trailer, uh, it's everywhere. We'd be super grateful for it. Yeah, and thank you, everyone on Twitter, for having such a big response and being so loud while we're not allowed to. Well, I'm really happy to have you guys here. I appreciate your outspokenness on, on some of the, uh, the criminal activity that does go on in, in Hollywood behind the scenes and certainly wish you well on the release of your new film. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.